This is Michael Cassie. Thanks for coming to our channel. I want to show you a few things you may need to be successful in the barber business or hairstyle and beautician business. Did you get you a good strong chair? I bought this chair about uh, 15 years ago, a little Belmont. Paid 19 or 20 bucks for it. Uh, I think the guy actually sold just a little bit too cheap. He was just starting to sell them then, and uh, I think this chair is probably three or four thousand dollars now if you could buy one of them. Real strong, heavy made chair. I've already had it recovered one time. I wore the seats out of it. Got some real strong material put back on there. You need some good clippers. You need some good. I like the Andis Master Clipper. I like the solid drive clippers also. Uh, this one takes the regular bulk out. It's a good clipper. Uh, you snap guards on it. You got your fade blade. You need a good fade blade. See how thin that blade is? Compared to this blade, this blade's more bulkier. I need you a real good thin fade blade to fade that line out that you have so much trouble with. Everybody does. That's a barber if you're fading out. You need something to fade that line out. You need a good edger, a T-edger, or either, I'm looking at this outliner here. Uh, this thing really works good, and a uh, good clipper. You need some good guards. You need a one-inch guard. You need three-quarter, half-inch, three-eighths, quarter, uh, one-eighth, one-sixteenth. That's the guards you need. There's seven different guards that are used that. You can fade right on down. When you're longer, use the scissors on top. Come down with your five on the side, one-inch blade on the side. Come down with three quarters. You can do it. You need a good razor, good straight razor. You need some good thinning shears to actually do the job. You need something that takes a lot of bulk out, less bulk out. You need some good, uh, good screwdriver to work on your stuff with. You're going to need it. You need some good uh, clipper cleaner. Oils a clipper and sprays cleans it. A lot of bacteria out there nowadays. You need to get rid of it. You won't be getting those bumps up and down the next few use that spray on it. Everybody might know they're going to have bumps on them. Yeah, they're going to have bumps because you're putting bacteria. Don't do that. Use your clippers. Cleaner. You can clean that clipper. Uh, you got your oil. Use your oil. You need it. Some good razors. Thin uh, razors. I like this. It's got a razor built into it. I bought this thing for like three or four bucks. Put the razors, put the razors in it over and over. You need a good pair of shears, of course. Pair of shears. You need a good another razor with guards on it you can use this and do your razor cut with it you need to use a razor if you don't use it you're missing if you don't because you have some good looking haircuts with that but i'm michael cassidy i hope that you received something off of listen to what you saw today maybe it helped you some but please subscribe to our channel if you enjoy what you see you'll be seeing a lot of different haircuts and no telling what you'll see what video put on here but join up with us thanks so much folks appreciate you i'm michael cassidy